most important thing is learning. I'm, I'm really into learning how people learn. Learning how people learn is, is understanding the key to figuring out how... Um, Josiah, hold on, what is it? Josiah, Josiah, what are you doing? I'm, I'm shooting a commercial right here. Oh, I'm playing, too. You're playing? Playing what? I'm playing your game. Playing my game? Are you playing, are you playing my, hold on a second, are you playing my game? Uh, kinda. What do you mean kinda? You can't, you can't kind of play people's game. You're either playing their game or you're not playing their game. Man, I'm playing your game. Okay, great. Well, thanks. Well, can I see what, hold on a second. This. You did. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> yeah, thanks, thanks. You can have it now. I'm, I'm dead. That's it. <laughs> Brick of Rocka makes software that rocks. He makes websites. My dad? He makes websites and owns his own business. He does Brick of Rocka? No. Awesome websites. That brick of rock of software. It means that um that their software rocks. Okay, my title with Brick of Bracca is creative director and practically speaking that means I am his personal documentarian and interior designer. And um, I also get to put together whatever projects come into Brian's mind. Uh, at any given moment with almost zero notice. Currently with Brick a Bracca, I uh, participate in their promotional events and also uh, I'm a videographer for the company. Brick a Bracca makes software that rocks. My favorite piece of technology would be the iPhone. Uh, I'd have to say TV. I don't like computers because they don't have the technology like on TV. My dad only wants me to have an hour of media because he doesn't want my brain to, to rot. Computer, Game Boy, PSV, PS3. Yeah, I would have to say my favorite piece of technology is my camera, my various cameras. It's probably the piece of technology that I understand best. I have an odd relationship with technology because uh, it's a love-hate relationship. Sometimes I love it because it enables you to do so much, to create so much, to connect with people in ways that as few as five, ten years ago we wouldn't even thought of being this connected. But uh, sometimes that's what I hate most about it too, always being connected and not being able to disconnect for a little bit. I think it's creative because when we were little, we watched movies and they had bric a brac in them, so we decided to name the software bric a brac -a. Is that he makes a lot of creative, creative things in it, but I haven't seen them, but a lot of people say that they're great. Brickabracka's motto of web software that rocks. Knowing Brian that he is working on the most forefront, um, cutting edge software, some kind of presentation that is um, eye grabbing, attention grabbing, and that is going to produce somebody a lot of business. I'm Brian Davis. I'm the CEO, Chief Executive Officer of Brickabracka Software. Actually, it's just brick a brick no software. That's, that's legal, I can't say software. It has to be just brick a brick because brick a brick might decide to, you know, start a band or something. Then it'll be brick a brick band. So what I did um, just about um, 11 months ago, this is November, um, is I started a company called brick a brick and um, people always ask the question, they want to know where Bricka Bracket came from. Bricka Bracket actually came from the Barney Show, all right? They were in the cavern where everything echoed. 
and all the kids were like saying their name like like or they were saying hello like hello 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 and say how are you how are you and like good morning and saying their name and stuff like that and then the little the little blonde haired um, blue eyed boy was like bricka bracka and everyone was like like why did you say that <laughs> and uh, no one knew why and like he was just like was just happy about just like saying bricka bracka and I was like, that is always stuck in my head. Like, why did he say break a What was he trying to tell us? Like, he was trying to get the message across to us. Everyone was saying everything else, and he said break a Like, that meant something. I didn't know what it meant. And it's always stuck with me. And then I think I realize now what he was trying to say. But I can't tell you because that's my knowledge. <laughs> but uh, break a bracket, it's a place where people can learn something new and learn that they can learn something new. When you know that you can learn something new, then your life is like reignited. You're a phoenix, you can soar. You're, you're a new person all over again. That's the most important part of Learning Center. Um, um, I was inspired by a friend, a very, very good friend that, that, that was, um, I, I knew from high school. And after meeting him again at a 10 year class reunion, um, you know, he was really frustrated with his career. And, you know, he knew that I was doing some of that web stuff. He said, hey, you know, you know, can you teach me some of that web stuff? I said, sure, man, let's come over to the house. And just step by step, he was building his confidence. Every week he was coming to the house, every week, every week. After a while, he didn't come anymore. I thought, well, you know, you know what happened to Benny? Like, Benny's not around anymore. Benny had, had, had learned that he can learn over again. He learned that he was, he had the ability to learn something new. And Benny was gone doing his own thing. Benny was off learning code fusion, flash, HTML, XML, everything. He, he, had, he had reinvented himself and got a new life. He, he, he um, got a new job, he got married, he got a kid, everything. His whole life it was just like, like brand new. And um, today he helps me with bric a -brac. It's wonderful. It's awesome to have him as a partner in bric a -brac because, you know, he was a person that didn't know anything about internet stuff. That's what bric a -brac is all about. It's about energizing the web with new applications that people have never thought of before. It's about energizing people with ideas that they haven't thought of before and about changing the world, you know, one person at a time.